Welcome back. Well, a lot of people have picked up new hobbies during the pandemic, including one local artist who expanded her line of work by using a new trendy medium. And what started as a handmade gift for her family turned into a side business. Our Morgan Koziar shows us how. Everything I make is custom mixed. Sarah Vogel is no stranger to creativity. They're all unique and really the possibilities are endless when it comes to designs and colors and patterns and shapes and you know you can just keep making keep diving deeper into that creative process. And while this is a new type of medium for Sarah, it's serving her well. It kind of took off and I'm having a blast with it. It's so much fun. Even if she didn't exactly plan on it happening this way. These polymer clay earrings are kind of trendy right now. And so back at Christmas time, I was like, oh, I could totally make those. They look like so much fun. I'll just get a few supplies and make them for gifts. And then I ended up posting a few pictures and people were like, oh my goodness, these are really cool. And I was like, maybe I should just post a few on Etsy and see what happens. And well, here I am. <laughs> three months later and I've probably sold over 500 pairs of earrings or more. But her creations are not only enjoyed by people here locally, but everywhere. I've sold them all across the country at this point. The majority of my customers are currently still local and part of that is because I'm also selling in two or three different local shops. And Sarah says the support is what helps her continue going. I think supporting local and supporting small, especially the arts, is extremely important especially during COVID. Um, I know a lot of people rely on these side jobs and these side businesses for income, and um, it's a way to just pour back into your community. Whether you like cutesy styles, statement earrings, or a simple stud, Sarah has designs that can fit everyone. In Altoona, Morgan Koziar, WTAJ News. And they look so, so neat, too. If you're interested in getting your hands on a pair, you can visit our website, wearecentralpa.com. Sarah is also going to be a part of a pop-up event at Wildfire in Martinsburg this Saturday, March the 20th, from 11 until 3.